Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do your daily vibes for the 8th, August 8th. Uh, keep in mind that the timing is fluid. You know, I hate to keep repeating myself, but it's part of the script. <laughs> anyway, here we go. This is for the 8th. What do we got for the eighth? Keep in mind that this reading is not sign specific. This is a general energy, okay? It may or may not be for you. We're just going to get one of these and see what comes up. What do we have for the eighth? Princess of Autumn. I have another one in my hand. We're going to take that one too. Studious, responsible, cheerful, and mischievous. Happy news about your career, promotions, or scholarships. Well thought out plans that go perfectly. Needing a little push to get going. <laughs> well, this is the Page of Pentacles and it feels as though somebody has gotten a little push or they're about to get one. They may have already gotten it. Um, happy news. Happy news is coming in about your career or your job or anything that is a new enterprise for you that could lead to abundance. Okay, the Page of Pentacles holds that pentacle in their hand. It's an opportunity to work hard, to manifest, to grow something stable and solid that could turn into something really, really big. So this is a day of about of plans, maybe making plans, starting. I mean, that is the first step, is to make the plan. So perhaps it's a day of planning. I'm willing to bet that it is. Six of spring. Oh, wonderful news. It's on its, it's on its way. Smart choices that bring rewards, success, and public recognition. This is the Six of Wands. Wonderful news. Smart choices that bring rewards, success, and public recognition. Somebody is about to be recognized for their work. This is success. Somebody is about to embark on a new successful endeavor. And the plans are in motion. Or they're about to be. They're about to be. Somebody may need that little push, but somebody's already gotten it. So, um, this is fantastic. It is fantastic. Wonderful news. Very good news. Um smart choices that bring rewards well wheel of fortune and it was it was upright it was but you know <coughs> we're going to take it as a challenge and i am going to turn it upright because i saw it upright um the challenge is uh going with the flow allowing it to happen spinning that wheel closing a chapter and starting a new one that is a challenge but I feel like it's destined. I feel like it's meant to be. This is absolutely positively meant to be. Destiny. Change of course. Fated. Whatever. This is good luck. Good fortune. So a new chapter is beginning. Whatever is happening is bringing you closer to your life's purpose. And this purpose has to do with what is going to make you successful. It has to do with your career, your money, your job, your home. broadening your horizons um, expansion somebody is about to expand their horizons it's a day of getting prepared to change your direction king of cups wow um, oh and the four of wands this is about commitment here we have uh, somebody that has really good intentions oh. This is somebody who is very intuitive. Somebody that is, um, this guy is emotionally balanced. 
his heart, and I'm going to say his, but at this point it could be his or her, unless I see something more drastic. This person's um, emotions are in check, and they have a uh, they have a big opportunity for emotional fulfillment here. It's a big cup right there. It's a big cup to be filled as well. Four of Wands. This is unexpected fortune. It's an unexpected happiness. Right around the corner. Right around the corner there is something there's some sort there's some sort of commitment that is going to make someone very, very happy. This could be with somebody who does have good intention, good does have good intentions and who is emotionally available. Doesn't matter what sign they are. A new idea. Wait, this is a new idea. Somebody has a new idea. Mm. Ooh. Wow. Burden. Somebody is very, very, very overwhelmed. Five of Swords reversed. Imagine that. We have an Emperor on the bottom. This is somebody who is very organized, somebody that is very um, decisive, this person is strong, this person is very masculine, protective, um, controlling, this person is very wise, this person is given to take action, this person um, is a boss, this person generally knows what to do, um, this person is very, very powerful. So the overall energy is control, structure, security. Hmm. We have somebody, this King of Wands, this King of Wands reverse. This is, a. Uh, what next to that Leo card reversed? I'm the Leo card, the strength card reversed. That is um, lack of energy. Somebody may not be happy. Somebody may be overwhelmed with a decision that somebody has made. They may be overwhelmed with somebody's new idea. Here, Somebody is, is, I mean, this somebody's been clinging, clinging to the memories. This is in your hopes and fears. In the hopes and fears position, we have somebody here that is fearful that somebody's going to be dropped. They're very fearful. I think it's that they're going to be dropped. I think we have somebody here that is overwhelmed with somebody's new idea. This right here, King of Wands reverse, this is uh, no energy, no drive, no desire, not happy, self-loathing. I feel like we have somebody here that is or doesn't have the courage and the confidence and the strength this is dropping burdens and this is the past to drop something from the past somebody doesn't have the courage to communicate or to speak up This guy is weak. We have somebody who is very weak. We have a, like, this is like a coward. We have a coward here. So we do. I mean, that's what that is. We have a coward here. We have a coward here who may have pushed somebody away and now they're overwhelmed. 
Now they are overwhelmed. They are feeling like this is too much. This is too much. I feel like we have somebody here that is changing their direction. They're getting prepared to go someplace else. They're getting, because that's what's happening here. Leaving the past behind, dropping it. We have somebody that is dropping it, dropping the past. I just want to be happy. I got nothing left to prove. I just want to be happy. I'm letting go of the emptiness. I'm taking back control. Somebody is about to take back control. That's what the emperor does. The emperor takes back control of the situation, makes a plan, definitely makes a plan, gets things in order, and then takes action. But here we have this king of king of wands reversed. This guy is, um, you know, the king of wands reversed. This person could be a narcissist, egotistical, lazy, unreasonable. So we may have this unreasonable individual who acted cowardly in the past that may, you know, now be opening his heart. That could certainly be the case, male or female, as of yet. But around the corner there is happiness and there is a commitment that is coming. But somebody has been clinging to the memories of the past and they are absolutely overwhelmed. And now it's like, I don't have anything to prove. I just want to be happy. What do I need to do to take back control of this situation? So this is a change of course. But the challenge is, is letting, because it came out sideways, right? Is letting go of the need to control. It's the letting go of the control. And this is letting go of the control. We have somebody here that has control issues, put it that way. Big time. This right here is communication. It's the raw truth and the whole truth and nothing but the truth. This is also a new idea. This is taking a new uh, new approach. This is getting prepared. Somebody may be getting prepared to act on this new idea that has been, you know, has come to them, whatever. I feel like this is a day of change, though, because that Wheel of Fortune is the very first card. This is a day of change, and it's positive change. It is positive change. But we do have somebody here that has been unreasonable. They haven't taken action because they were weak or lazy or cowardly or whatever. And it's like, and you got to see where they're connected. It's like now, now all of a sudden they're emotionally available. Now they're ready to open their heart. This person is very burdened. This is probably the same person. We have somebody here that is very overwhelmed. Ooh, we have somebody here that is very self-sufficient. Somebody that is enjoying the finer things in life that can take care of themselves quite well. This is abundance. This is, this is money. This is stability. This is security. This is, this is having it all. I can take care of myself just fine. So we have somebody here that is doing very, very well. Grateful. The storm is over. The storm is over. I'm letting go of the past. She's not even looking at it anymore. She's not even interested. Not even interested in the past anymore. Here we have somebody that has been trapped, confined, contained, constricted. And all they have to do is escape. So it looks like we have somebody here that is about to escape from the confines that they have kept themselves in. But we do have somebody that is looking back. We have somebody, you see, some, we have somebody that is looking back. We have somebody here that um, 
is very sneaky. This person is sneaky. This person is um, very clever. He's all dressed in black. He's he's in the shadows. You know, he can hide. He hides very, very. He hides himself very, very well. But he is watching this person grow. He is watching this person. He's he's also watching this person get ready to break free. Seven of seven of pentacles reversed. Dissatisfied. Somebody's not satisfied that this person is relocating or going someplace else or doing something else. They didn't put in effort. They didn't they didn't make it grow. They didn't put they didn't have faith in a connection. You know, they didn't do the work that they needed to make something successful. And now we have this person that has a new opportunity a new vision, a new opportunity for growth. We have a new spark, a new flame. It's like God is giving this person a new opportunity that is going to grow very quickly. It's going to grow into something very, very abundant. It is. It's also going to bring love. <laughs> Unbelievable. So we have somebody here that is being freed from some sort of burdens. And I feel like we have a plan. Somebody, And that's what the emperor does too as well. Makes a plan. So I feel like we have a plan that is being drawn up. And we have somebody that is watching. This is a very sneaky, shady, sly SOB. He is watching this person prosper. He's, he's, this person's been confined by, it's like narcissistic behavior. Okay. Right here. Okay. That's narcissistic behavior. It's like their supply is floating away. So we do have a new passionate beginning here. New, it's like this new opportunity just opens right up. Which leads probably to a new sexual partner, a new partnership of some sort. This says, go for it. Just go for it. Go for it. So I feel like we have an independent person also that may be receiving an offer from somebody or may be receiving some sort of, you know, information. This guy's an intuitive. Some information from somebody that you know, gives them this new vision and sends them in a new direction. So I feel like this is a day of planning. We have a new opportunity here that could grow. There's no more growth here. This is unrealistic. It's dissatisfying. We have somebody here that is watching. They are not happy. Um, there's been lies. There's been deception. And perhaps there, may, there could be some sort of communication. There could be some acceptance of the truth. Whatever it is, this is the truth. Somebody could receive some sort of communication. Or this person has received a wake-up call that this other person is leaving. Whatever the case is. Um, happiness is right around the corner. Which includes commitment and success. Happy news about your career, promotions or scholarships, well thought out plans that go perfectly. Needing a little push to get going. Wonderful news is on its way. Smart choices that bring rewards, success and public recognition. This Ace of Wands, that's a new creative inspiration a new creative endeavor that grows it grows it gets bigger and bigger and bigger and it's going to bring in plenty of money good luck <laughs>